welcome to another edition of the Market Opening Gong, where we bring you updates from the Nigerian capital markets. This edition captures the market performance for Wednesday, December 23rd, 2020. From the Nigerian Stock Exchange, the equities market maintained uptrend as trading activities closed on a positive note as NSC ESI appreciated by 2.40% for the day as investors gained $475.69 billion. Its year-to-date returns currently stands at 44.56%. The All-Share Index closed at 38,803.74 basis points with a market capitalization of 20.28 trillion naira in 4,316 deals. The market closed with 26 gainers to 7 losers. The top gainers for equity were Associated Bus Company, Japal Gold and & Ventures, and Airtel Africa, while the top losers were FCMB Group, PZ Cousins Nigeria and La Sacco Assurance. Access Bank, Veritas Capital Assurance and Flower Mills Nigeria were the most active to boost market turnover. The NSI advanced by 0.04 to close at 722.1 basis points, while the market capitalization declined by 3.43 to close at 518.6 billion naira. The change in volume traded advanced to close at 1.40 million, while the value traded closed at 1.11 million in two deals executed for the day. The FMDQ Group Debt Market Size closed at 24.33 trillion naira. The NAFEX rate declined by 0.20% to close at 392 naira 14 cobol, while the INE FX rate advanced by 0.32% to open at 393 naira 13 cobol and declined to close at 392 naira to a dollar. You can also check for global, commodity, currency, and other indices on the economic dashboard showing on your screen. For the market highlights from yesterday, in response to the IFRS consultation on sustainability reporting, the International Organization of Securities Commission supports the establishment of a sustainability standards board. In the media release, it highlights that securities and other capital market authorities are responsible for the oversight of capital markets and often have responsibilities for disclosure regulations. IOSCO believes that robust sustainability reporting standards interconnected with financial reporting standards will also support audit and assurance, enhancing the market's trust in sustainability disclosures and laying the foundations for mandatory corporate reporting on sustainability internationally. And that brings us to the end of this edition of the Market Opening Gong. Visit www.proshareng.com to get more market updates. Do connect with us on our social media platforms displaying on your screen. Until we come your way again, thank you for watching.